If you want to see, sing along with me. If you want to build a bridge. Students and postdocs in the biomedical fields have a great variety of career paths to choose from in and out of academia. Staying informed about academic career options may be easier as a trainee in an academic institute, but where can trainees go to learn about the variety of non-academic career paths? Turning to Google or going to your career center are just two great options. Another great option would be to attend an awesome event such as Building Bridges. To create this event, Valerie Tutwiler, a postdoc at the University of Pennsylvania, submitted and received an early career meeting grant from the American Society of Cell Biology. ASCB. The vision behind the building bridges between academia and industry meeting was to expose graduate students and postdocs to the variety of careers that are available to them within industry in a one-day setting. The goal of this meeting was to make sure that the attendees were able to make informed career decisions and gain the knowledge to do so earlier on in their training. To achieve this vision, we developed a team of graduate students and postdocs within the Philadelphia region and partnered with Drexel University to host this event. We decided on the round table and short talk sessions to ensure that the attendees were exposed to the widest variety of careers possible during this time. Because uh, we all have heard the phrase many times, science is a team effort. Uh, no one laboratory, no one department, no one uh, college or university for that matter uh, uh, is really uh, uh, the sole uh, uh, source of uh, ideas and opportunities uh, and best practices uh, for the education and training of our students. And so the more we all collaborate together across all of these realms, uh, the better will be the environment for our uh, students and fellows uh, that we uh, uh, take under our uh, guidance. A number of the uh, students and postdocs that came in wanted uh, help with their CVs or conversion of CV to resume because of the different paths they were looking at. So uh, in those cases we focused on better drawing out their stories, um, highlighting who they were within those experiences uh, and finding their voice. Earlier, I would say this year or so, I have uh, made the decision to switch from industry, uh, from academia to industry, and this was a perfect event to uh, to attend to learn more about opportunities that are out there. So I wasn't really looking to find my career path. Um, I was more going to just hear what people had to say, but um, I was pleasantly surprised because I got to hear um, a lot of stories and um, experiences that people had um, that really resonated for me. Uh, there's a fantastic mix of professionals uh, across demographics as well as across um, professional tracks or paths and it was all, the messaging was almost universal and quite um, incidental. It was not planned. Um, on uh, how much network matters and how much um, just following who you are. Followed up with the number of the speakers uh, that I met there and um, I have made plans. I've mentioned to them in person that I will be reaching out to them in the future to talk more about their uh, basically to set up informational interviews. Some I already basically conducted at the event uh, and some I plan to do after the fact. Mm -hmm. So for me personally, I thought what was missing was the, the element of uh, immigration and the, how, the challenges that the foreign nationals face in, um, in their search for uh, career opportunities in the industry, because that also factors into decision making. Um, I liked how local it was, and I really, really appreciated and enjoyed the collaborative atmosphere um, from students to postdocs to faculty to um, people in the field. I think it would be a great event to have every year, all the time. <laughs>
It is incredibly worthwhile for career centers, graduate and postdoc offices, as well as student and postdoc trainees to collaborate to stretch their personnel and financial resources.